Hey guys, and welcome back to Halo Wars 2. When we last left off, we finished Operation Spearbreaker, which was a very short DLC, but uh, short but sweet, where we stopped the Banished from launching a Forerunner ship right into a collision course with the uh, Spirit of Fire. That would have been bad. <laughs> um, so anyway, whilst uh, the Spirit of Fire... I assume is now waiting for Anders to return from her journey on the Halo, which, well, she's <laughs> not going to. Mm. Uh, we're going to play Awakening the Nightmare, which apparently... Uh, Awakening the Nightmare, the Banished fight a desperate battle against a terrifying and ancient enemy on the Ark. So, the Flood are apparently on the Ark. Um... That's not really a surprise. Wherever there are forerunners, there is flood because for some reason, when the forerunners were um, cataloging, or at least the librarian was indexing and cataloging um, as many populations of uh, indigenous creatures as possible throughout the galaxy to reseed after the Halo event, uh, they decided to keep some flood alive for reasons. Hindsight being 2020, bit silly really, but there we go. So let's go. A uh, yes. I'm gonna go normal. Do not disobey your orders again. <laughs> Scout the shell, salvage the ships. That is it. Atriox was clear. I'll look around. And if we find prizes to bring back... <laughs> how could that go wrong? Voridus, listen. You fail him one more time, trying to prove yourself, and I will not be able to save you. And it will be both our skulls beneath his mace. Relax, brother. You worry too much. Hmm. That guy's Have a bit of a dick bag. We are ready to move to high charity. My men are impatient for glory. Put a leash on them, Voridus. The terrain here is unsuitable for our power extractors. I am still working on a solution. And your men would do well to remember that whatever we find here belongs to Atriox. This war has tamed you, brother. Where is your Jirohane lust for adventure? That relic is ripe for plunder. This war has taught me, Voridus. Stay your hand. Once we reach High Charity, we need to move quickly to avoid the wrath of the Sentinels defending it. Yes, yes. I am well aware of what we face here. Hurry your preparations, old one. I already have troops on the ground. Void us out. Hmm, this is kind of interesting, seeing from the Banished point of view. Um, High Charity, of course, was on the Ark. Yes, uh, it crashed there during the events of uh, Halo... Is that Halo 2, Halo 3? I can't remember now. I only played them a few days ago, but those two games especially roll into one. Because they're basically a direct continuation of each other. Um, trouble is, High Charity brought the Flood Infestation and the Grave Mind. Now, they did fire a Halo um, to neutralize it. So, that's going to be interesting to see what happened. I'm pretty sure they wiped the flood out. It was on high charity. Because they destroyed high charity and then they neutralized. Yeah, okay. Interesting. Alright. Let's see what you got, game. Welps. Did you say high charity? The Covenant Capital Place? I heard it was haunted. Scary monsters everywhere. Whoa, man. Back off the gas. <laughs> Silence. Those covenant lies do not concern me, and that means they do not concern you. Little butterflies Notice, and things. There are many sentinels amassing here near the salvage site. They may be guarding rather than protecting something within high charity. The old stories of the parasite. Nothing but covenant. 
propaganda, old friend. You had uh, signals near you and let me deal with the ones here. We'll have what we need in no time. Yeah, uh, if we unleash the flood on the Ark, that's really bad. <laughs> you gotta love the grunts, though. There's not a lot left of high charity either. Reapers? These are Reapers, I guess. I look forward to it. Oh, these are Reavers. As you command. Right, okay, so they can rocket jump. Ready to launch. Yeah, great. Can I have both of you, please? Thank you. Oh boy. We are typical brutes, I guess. Uh, I found it quite uh, interesting that these two uh, new characters were both shaved. Shaved monkeys. They look quite interesting. <laughs> Retro. Uh, you gotta feel sorry for the grunts. Grunts are basically little more than slaves. They have quite a pathetic existence. Right, let's get this barrier down and see what we're dealing with. Oh, we get to keep that now. I like the banter between the two. They've done a very good job capturing the spirit of these guys. Yeah, I suddenly don't feel bad for spending my money because um, they've put the effort in. They really have. What's this way? Let's explore. Ooh, Phoenix Logs. And we have some more resources too. So what support do we have? Well, we don't have we don't have a support menu. Okay. Curious. The music. The music's cool. Alright, let's destroy these sentinels. Yeah, you guys are really Opening up Pandora's box here. We're gonna lose that squad. Nothing but worms. I like it. It's poor grunts. Nothing more than to pad out the ranks. Expendable chaff. What is this scanning? What is that? <laughs> what weapon should I use? Any weapon you like, as long as it gets the job done. There's a lot of sentinels coming out there. Uh, leader menu. Disruption emitter. Now, hit them while they are defenseless. Oh, okay. Orders. The EMP field from that emitter is fluctuating. I made a few improvements, and now it affects a much larger area. 
Yeah. Improvements have shortened the duration of the EMP field. You will need to replace it soon. Right. Let's go. I guess we have to build up our base. Oh, this is cool. Right, so power extractor. Let's upgrade that bad boy. Uh, what else do we have here? Probably going to want to drop some turrets in. War council. Hero structure. Uh, foundry apex. Going to need to build defenses. Raid camps, harvester. Let's get some harvesters. Yeah. Upgrade the turrets and build more turrets. Uh, anti air. Right, what have we got here? Make sure we have reavers on the ground as well. Anti air upgrade. Anti air upgrade. So how long does disruption emitter last for? This is quite interesting. Right, grab all this stuff. Right, upgrade. Upgrade. So let's get an apex and a war council, I suppose. See what vehicles we get to play with. Why not? I like these spirits that come in. I do like the spirits that are coming in. Right, go grab those resources. Are you upgrading? You're not upgrading. You need repairs. Okay, cool. Right. Um, Apex, War Council. Yeah. Right, well, let's take these things down. We need all the resources we can find. Oh, I see. So I'm guessing. Guessing we need to take all of these out. That will be done. Yeah, because at the moment... Yeah, that only stuns it. Interesting. These missile units are very effective. Yeah, this is going badly. Right, back off. Back off. Okay. Right, we need to find some way... Yeah, we need to find some way of actually dealing with these guys. Because that's not working. Do we? Rain of fire. Healing area. Okay, so we do actually get that. Which is nice. Right, let's get some healing, healing stuff going. Wow, these things are nasty. Um, shrapnel mines, shrapnel rounds guess we can get some grunt squads out. Wow, they are so cheap. Okay. And also, we can get this. Let's go take this power generator. Because again, our bottleneck at the moment. Our bottleneck is power, as always. Alright, grab this stuff. We've almost got enough for an upgrade. What can we get with the war? Okay, so the powers are like basically the same. I guess that makes sense. Power nodes. Yeah, we kind of need something that's going to help. Alright, let's upgrade this base. Um, what have we got? There's some more resources over there. So what is... So we seem to only really... Oh, we can get engineers. Engineers are forerunner uh, creatures. They're living machines. Right now. 
but we're using them as slaves, unfortunately. Which is not good. That's nice. We have placed the markers to show the route for your scarab. Oh god, right, okay. That's not brilliant. Disruption emitter. Right, let's knock that one out. We've got engineers now. How are we doing on that? Not very well. Okay. Well, we're going to have to go. Good. We've built turrets. Those will help protect our base as we make our way to high charity. Yeah. Although they're not... Well, I don't know. They're actually kind of holding out. Um, everything's upgraded. I don't really want to waste all my population cap, yes, on bloody grunts. Let's go for a raid camp and a foundry, I guess. Yeah, we should be able to handle pretty much everything they have to throw at us. New, yeah. I'm guessing we can't actually destroy these things. War Council upgrade. So we can upgrade them. We can get new recruits. Increases the squad size. It's probably a good thing. There's still so much wreckage lying around high charity. It's going to take me a while to carve through it. Next yeah, well you carve through it. I hope they clean up after themselves. <laughs> yeah, don't we all? Um, see with caution, Vordis. There are strange readings from inside the wreckage. You know the tales of the Grave Mind and the corruption it spread inside High Charity. If true, then it could be a greater threat than even the Covenant were. Yeah. More lies from the prophets. Even if there was once such a threat, any monsters would be long dead by now. Are we sure about that? Are you, are you absolutely positive about that? Right, let's use this squad to go and scout. The base should be able to hold out for itself. Right, we've got the foundry now. We can get Marauder or Reavers. Um, let's get some Marauders for our scout squad. Not. Why are they here? I have bigger matters to attend to, but I may be able to spare another unit. Well, that's not brilliant. The scouting party was too small to be out this far without a base. Shit. Oh, good. Oh, wonderful. So we have humans to deal with as well. Uh, that's a pain. Right, let's go squish the humans. Chopper. Oh, we can get choppers now. Right, cool. You. Go over here. We need to sort these humans out. Um, so, okay. So we're going to be like, we have. So they must have a base down here, which is problematic. Yeah, cool. You keep going. That's good. Foundry, let's upgrade vehicles. Raid camps, upgrade our soldiers. Weird to have grunts on our side. Um, yeah, I'm not convinced. 
I'm not convinced, to be honest, that um, the humans are going to be much of a threat. Yeah, cool. So we're going to have to be in two places at once, aren't we? Right, go down here. We have encountered a new forerunner defense system. Turrets. The area oh, around the security is more for protect your scarab. Do your duty. We are protecting the scarab, and we're repairing the scarab. Where they want and destroy any who oppose. Is Atriox's rise not proof of this? Atriox oh god. Is cunning as well as strength. A wise warrior does not pick a fight with an unknown foe. Yeah, you got a point. Okay. Kill these guys, please. As much as that pains me to take out the UNSC, we don't have much choice at the moment. Nice. Cool. Keep it going. Uh, we can upgrade, but it's so expensive. Okay. What is that? Oh, it's one of those caches. Let's take it. Uh, yep, yeah, I'm kind of on the air units. Alright, grab the stuff. So what is... Oh, God. Okay, so that actually disables the turrets. Nice. Scarab is getting damaged. It's not too bad. Alright, you do that. So this one's going to be interesting. We literally got to be everywhere at once. Oof. Yeah, I want to try. What is ah, engineer? Do you want to try and capture everything as much as we possibly can? Why are they picking on you? Because you're a grunt. Right, take that. Okay, so that one's good. How are we doing? Still not brilliant, but they are holding their own there. Right, stick a turret in there. Oh, God. I didn't notice that. Yeah, go stick those guys there. Heal the squad. Don't worry about anything else. There we go. Should be able to overpower the damage that that thing's putting out. Come on. Take that turret. Take it. Take it. Take it. Come on. There we go. Right. Go over there. Stick a turret down. Uh, Anti-air. There is. Well, in that case, that's what, what we'll have. Oh, it's only a basic base. Take the base so we can divide the Sentinel's focus and stagger their attacks. Yeah. Scarab must make it to high charity in one piece. Alright. Go over here, guys. How are we doing? Uh you need to be anti air. Anti air. Ah, enemy four. Right, not bad, not bad. Go over here. You didn't need that. Oh, great. Uh. The wreckage is nearly destroyed. Get ready to move. Okay, that's fine. Um, guys, go take that, please. Okay, at least we've actually repaired the Garab. Uh, I don't think that's the extent of their defences, no. Damn it. Stop pulling my attention away. <laughs> I'm kind of busy here. Can we attack the turrets, please? You know, like the actual main threat. That's the stuff. Right, you guys. Right, 
Keep it up. Keep it up. Oh, shit. Yeah, that's not brilliant. The humans are here. What? If they crept beneath our scans, their forces must be small. Simply a reconnaissance mission. Then I'll make sure they don't report anything back. Yeah, well, we'll do what we can, but... Disable those turrets. Enemy vehicles! This is not exactly going smoothly, is it? Come on, let's get the rest of our forces in there. It's all good. It's all good. We got this, I think. That'll do. Alright, let's burn these guys out. Okay, so it is only a tiny little base. Let's buff everything we have. That garrison's got to go. We're trying. We're trying. Oh god, they got turrets. Um, Scarab's getting battered. Really need to get these done. Uh, burnouts. Rain of fire. That could be nice. Right. Yeah, so you say, but I think we're doing okay, actually, guys. Yeah, we got it, we got it. We got engineers, it's fine. Alright, take these turrets out. It's not the vehicle that you want to worry about. Okay, cool. That's not good. There are more weapons for us to plunder. Uh, warned us not to enter high charity forward us. Focus on salvaging what remains around it. Yeah, this is sounding like it's going to get uh, worse by the second. Go repair those. Right. Let's go for boundary. And we'll go for a harvester. And a power extractor. Okay, so I think we're kind of getting there. We desperately need to patch up our scarab anyway. Um, do we have any other troops around? Right, let's get these turrets built. Let's have you anti-air. So, what do we have littered around? Halfway through the wreckage. I mean, that's good. Yeah, I would be careful what you wish for, guys. Right, can we go for max level? Oh, can't quite afford it. Almost afford it. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on. There we go. Rain of fire is ready. Nice. Can we go for... Oh, almost, 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 almost. Right, let's turn you off. Uh, let's get you upgraded. Let's get you repaired. And let's get you... As an anti-air unit. Right, go regroup over there. There's probably stuff over here too. Yeah, we're good. We're good. We got it. We got it. We got it. Anti-air. At least these turrets will hold these things back. Patch these guys up a little bit on the way past. What building's been destroyed? Where is the challenge? What building has been destroyed? Right, okay, everything's fine. Let's, clear. Let's get going. Power ready. 
Um, I would like that. Attach some turrets there. Uh, we've lost that, haven't we? We have. Can you upgrade to be anti-air, please? You guys go over there so we can rebuild that turret. How's the scab doing? Scab's doing fine. Foundry. Let's get some more of these guys out. Right, all these guys. Who's being ambushed? Right, you guys. Okay. Because <laughs> they're annoying. That's why they must plague us. Oh, shit. Um, yeah. I can see that. Yeah, we can see that. We can see that. Alright, go catch up with the scar, please. Uh, cool. Alright, let's go. What's going on over here? Let's get a turret down. We only have one turret here? No, there we go. Oh. Kill that. Use whatever the hell weapons you have. Come on, guys. Uh, your target is literally here. Can we not... Right, let's take that down. The scarab is under attack. Yeah, I can see that, but the scarab is also moving quicker than we are, which is a problem. I don't know if that's going to take these guys out. Right, engineers, can you like go and heal the scarab, please? Oh god, we've lost the scarab. Or have we? Oh my god, that was that was as close as it gets. I don't know how we didn't lose the scarab there. I don't know how the hell we didn't lose that there. Holy shit. Right, okay, cool. Activate the light bridge. Yeah, activating the light bridge would be good. But, before we do that, let's make sure we have turrets online. And make sure that our scarab is fully repaired. So, what we got left? Build on all turret slots near the launch base. Uh, that's built. They're built. Can we get these guys repaired a little bit? Okay, so these turrets we need to get sorted. Make way for the marauder. Yeah, go sort those out. Actually, you guys go up there. These guys are going to have a little bit of a scout. See what we can find. Our base is fine. One of our emitters has expired. Prepare another. Right, can we upgrade? Let's get over here. Who has sent what to harass you? Yeah, we're gonna activate the light bridge. Chill out. We've got missions to accomplish. Looks like we've lost the if we lost the turrets here again, we have. Might be worth sending our engineers down there in a minute. Right, let's get some turrets set up. Shame we can only put two turrets here. Where have we lost? Yeah, we've lost the turrets there, haven't we? Kind of unfortunate. Let's shut you down whilst we set up. Uh, yeah, don't worry, don't worry. We're on it, we're on it. Kind of. Load up the 
Right, grab that. I think this is probably going to be a losing battle here, I think. I mean, we can handle these little ones. It's just the bigger ones that are kind of a pain in the ass, to be honest. Uh, we can get reinforcements, which is probably a good idea. Right, you shouldn't really be able to kill these guys. Disruption emitter. Shouldn't really be able to kill these guys. Thick hide. Greatly increases armor. I thought that was just for ghosts, but I guess not. Right, let's go for you. And you. Let's drop a disruption emitter down here. Oh god. Right, thick hide, that's good. So, I mean, I'm guessing every time we upgrade... It's not the raid camp, is it? It's Actually, we could get that. New recruits. Quite expensive, but it'd be worth it. Every time we upgrade that, does that improve all of our turrets? I'm not sure, to be honest. Right, there we go. Yeah, we can see that. Unfortunately, they just chip away. Turrets, turrets, both ready. Cool. Yeah, it's those bigger ones. Right, so what we want is... Let's go for... Our foundry. Right, and we're back. Okay, so... Prepare another emitter. We've used one up. Right, foundry. That's what we wanted. Let's get some of these out. Shrapnel rounds. Wall council. Get that done. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We know. We know. All right, get the turret going. You cannot out damage three engineers, surely. Right, you guys, go over here. Right, you. Have we lost those turrets? No, we haven't. Okay. Watch out! Coming through. Get these air units off of us. So two turrets and two of those on each side should be enough to keep those guys back. At least if we can keep enough of them back, burn out. They attack us from the sky. Hmm. That sounds interesting, burnout. But Enemy air I don't know, man. Get one ready. Show me in this. Yeah, that's more like it. They can't even yeah, they're not even getting out now. Yep, not even getting out. That's the ticket. They know where to stick it. And then, because that is going to constantly attack our base. So the only thing now, you, 
go and stand by this turret. Because they shouldn't actually get attacked then. Turrets. Turrets. Get these air units off of us. Yeah, the air units are not on you, so chill the fuck out, dude. Right, I'm thinking that that should be enough. The enemy's air units picked the wrong target. At least these guys have got a shield as well. And obviously these guys should level up as they go. What the hell is that thing firing at? Yeah, they're just going to level up. Cool. Ain't nothing getting past this one now. That's how we do it. Yeah, that's how we do it. That's how we do it. Okay. Get these air units off of us. So we need to get this one sorted. Although I'm under fire from air units. I will show them. Ah, this one up here. This one up here is a problem. So, can we put any turrets around here? Enemy air units attacking. No. But we can shut it down. Okay, so that's going to be absolutely mental source through there. Right, what are we doing? Uh, near the launching base. I guess that's the only one that we haven't. The enemy's air units picked the wrong target. Yeah, I'm sure they did. Um, right, so what have we got left? Not a lot. Don't want a the chopper. Air units to harass me. Let's no. go for a foundry. Wow, they're expensive though. And let's squad them up with I some grunts. So what can we actually I'm getting good at beam this. cannon? Dark skies. Let's go for that. Check the dampening coils. They attack from the right. Power Let's go into the middle. How many caches have we got left? Just capsule power nodes. Oh, there's a lot of resource caches that we haven't got yet. Yeah. Upgrade they ain't got nothing. Yeah, they're just gonna rank up so fast. Dark skies, He's rank one already. Nice. What is that? I have no idea. There has to be something up here. There's another cache. Cool. Get it. Get it. Get it. This is a good learning um, ability anyway, or learning run, to learn what all the different moves and whatnot are doing. Uh, okay, you, can you go up here? You can. Is there actually anything up here? No. Well, that's a pain. Right, War Council. How's that doing? Show me the flying pests. Right, let's get everything here repaired. They from the air. Yes, they dare attack you. I know how how nasty of them. Anything else to research? Not they really. From above? Fools. That's disappointing. And our turrets are now outputting a lot more damage. Right. 
We just got missiles flying all over the map. Get another one out there. Uh they attack us from the sky. Yeah, we're Rebel good. Right, let's get you. There has to be something over here somewhere. There has to be. Another cache. That's a lot of caches that we're missing, though. That's still four. There's got to be another power node over here as well. We can build a mini base there, but there's no real point. The only thing that would make that mini base worth it is if we could um, put some turrets down. Alright. Let's have a little explore, see what we can find. It's got to be more stuff around here, there has to be. So anything that we can do here, recycle, lockdown. I don't know what that does. Units are trained as normal but remain inside base. That's quite interesting. There we go. That's going to be a pain. So you've got to get them to jump over there to attack that. Yeah, you are. Can you not destroy that? Yes, you can. I don't know why you didn't. There's the other node. Right, we're going to need, like, brute jump troops to get that. Raid camp. Do we have a raid camp here? We do not. Let's get a raid camp. You guys are fine. Chill the fuck out. I can sit here and drink coffee. Yeah, you're pissing me off with your bullshit. Um, there we go. Didn't actually want to use burnout, but sure. Not sure if we use burnout. Jump pack brutes. Uh... Go on, we get two units of jump pack brutes. Yeah, we always need something smashed in the Halo universe. Right. I'm going to say the one thing it might have been worth attaching to this team would have been an engineer. But it's fine. It's fine. How are these guys doing? These guys are doing just fine. Right. No engineers for you guys. Yes, there's always... Something. Ooh. Right. Okay. Probably could have gone for a couple of these. There's an engineering team here. Uh, go support these guys. Yeah, we need um, you guys to move your fucking ass. That was not good. I wish I could, like, recycle this thing and get another one of these. Come on, guys. Come on. Now, these guys, we need to capture that. And that's another objective done. We can hit it with that. In all fairness, let's lock that one down. The fools have sent air 
chance to harass me. They'll learn. Right, you can get patched up. You lot can jump over here. You stay with them. Let's get a turret set up. Yeah, there's plenty of action, guys. Plenty of action. Let's get dangerous. Yeah, I'm not sure where all these other caches are. We have? What building? Doesn't look like we lost anything from my... Uh, from my point of view. Alright, let's get some anti-air action going on there. Are you not done? You're not done. You guys, go over there. What about you? You're done. Well, I mean, at least they make short work. Yeah, that's certainly working. Right, turret improved, turret improved. Captured that. Oh. Not quite sure what that blue thing is that's now... Oh, that's the shield that these things create. Oh, that's interesting. Well, we don't need to grab those resources. Hmm. I guess I'll explore this one off, off camera. Ah, oh, there's probably more over the bridge, actually. Thinking about it. Alright, let's go, guys. You guys. Go over that. So, where are we at here? We've done all of that. Ah, right. So, there's only two Covenant resource caches left, which could be over here. Let's shut this one down. Give him a bit of a rest. Grunt squad, under aerial assault. grunt squad? Well, we don't really care about the Grunt Squad, let's be honest. Let's get these guys healed up. Once the rest of the squad gets through, we can move on. We've certainly got plenty of engineers. I still can't believe we actually managed that. It was literally hovering on 0% health. Surely 0% is nothing? I mean, I don't know. I'm not an expert. I'm not a mathma wizard. Alright, everybody pull back. Everybody pull back. Alright, now we've got some engineer action going on. Should be able to keep all these guys healed up. There we go. Guys, go activate the light bridge. Hey, that's what I do. I waste time. Well, these things literally have zero chance against us. See what we've got over here. Pavio, I found some kind of forerunner interface, and there are more sentinels nearby. Oh, goody. Be careful, Boridus. There is still much we don't understand about the forerunners and their machines. You may make things worse. Don't yeah. Worry, brother. I can handle it. I'm going to investigate. Scarab Commander, continue smashing through that wreckage. Uh. The scarab while I try and deactivate the sentinel defenses. That doesn't sound overly smart, but okay. 
Yeah, Vordus is not very smart, is he? You could say he's void of brains. <laughs> Vordus of brains. But that's standard for brutes. Okay, so I'm not seeing any equipment caches over here. But that's fine. I guess I'll find the rest off camera. That's annoying. That's why I don't really like going for these secondary objectives on camera because uh, if I can't find them, then it's just a waste of time. But hey. Uh, they probably didn't need that. I mean, that's a sentinel. They have millions of sent. Oh, we can, we can all shoot this. Yeah, nothing's going to stop the scarab. We've got way too many engineers for that. My question is, yet again, you stupid aliens are unleashing the flood. Generally, if this area is really locked down, there's usually a reason for it. But you're not smart enough to realise that. Oh, let's take these turrets out. What are you getting attacked by? Oh, everything. Alright, let's pop some turrets. Come on, Scarab. We are literally going to unleash hell. Yeah, we are using everything we have. What weapon should I use? Uh, use all of the weapons. You'll show them what? How dumb you are? By unleashing the flood? Yeah, well, the Covenant didn't really like to uh, upset the Forerunner. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Oh, they'll be transporting something. That... They'll be transporting something back. Oh, God. Oh god. Oh god. Oh uh, yeah, you you uh you do that. Wait. Oh shit. Wait, what am I doing? Oh, you're kidding me. Uh I guess Right, that one's good. Okay. Okay, it's not quite as hard as I thought it was going to be. At least it actually highlights when you've got it right. Oof. 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 A puzzle? That was actually quite a cool idea, to be honest. Yeah, I'm guessing Vornus uh, is going to be the first to be infected. Yeah. Yeah. Let's go get rewarded, guys. Why have they built a shield around High Charity? Hmm, I wonder.
Uh oh. Yeah. Yeah, that was bad. Oh, dude. Oh. Oh, shit. Oh, dude, what is that? Oh, boy. Let's reactivate the Sentinels. Oh, God. Oh man, he's cool. Oh god, what have you wrought? What have you wrought, you stupid apes? Once again, the might of the banished shines through. You mean the brawns of the banished? Because you've now just unleashed absolute fucking hell on the ark that the um, sentinels have obviously tried so hard to keep locked up oh well <laughs> um i mean as the dlc pack has started <laughs> this is cool i really like this this is quite interesting um i mean vortus died or vortus whatever he was called uh, i mean surprise right but the way he went was pretty cool oh the flood Mm. They're always lurking in the depths somewhere, aren't they? So, I am guess... I mean, technically, when we were destroying the Flood, uh, the end of um, one of the games, in high charity, uh, Halo 3, actually, it was, um, Cortana did say this will hurt them. She didn't say it was going to destroy them, so... Guess we just significantly reduced their population. Now, my charity has been dormant for a long time um, and encapsulated by the Forerunner. So it's quite interesting. I guess the Flood can actually survive. Well, we know they can survive as spores for eons. We know that. But it's interesting that they can survive in combat forms and infection forms for at least a few good amount of time uh, without requiring to feed or, or anything so yes ah oh, the flood is such an interesting enemy um i guess the grave mind is in there uh that would be bad <laughs> this is shaping up to be a very very interesting dlc pack what what a game halo wars 2 has been so far oh what an underrated gem of a game if you're a halo fan anyway i guess i mean even if you're not it's still a good time um it's a little bit simple because obviously it's built for the ground up for consoles so it's very simplistic but it's it's a solid game <sighs> what a shame these games just don't sell i think halo wars should be marketed more to uh, the pc audience anyway because the good strategy games still do sell pretty well. But the trouble is, even though it is on PC, many people that are hardcore into first-person uh, strategy games know that it's a dumbed-down experience. And it is absolutely a dumbed-down experience. But it's such a shame. I mean, with the power of the new Xbox... They could do so much with a strategy game now. You don't have to... I guess you do have to pander to the control pad. 
Um, I, I don't know. I don't know how they... Because obviously, I can't ever imagine Microsoft bringing a, a PC-only game uh, out these days. It would have to run on their Xbox, and that's fine. And, you know, you can use a mouse and keyboard on... Um, your series x i'm sure that's not an issue at all but obviously most console gamers are, are terrified of the mouse and keyboard but you know there are plenty of genres of game at least a few genres of game where absolutely the control pad is the right way to go uh, i can think of like driving games um some third-person games really are much suited to a controller in my opinion but then there are games that are more suited towards the keyboard like first-person shooters and strategy games uh, anyway I'm rambling so I hope you enjoyed that that first long-winded look at this new DLC I cannot wait for more so I'm gonna dive into the next level right now <laughs>